Hey there. <clears throat> this video is about how to fill in a ring magnet. Like there are times when you have ring magnets and you go, well, that's a great big magnet, but geez, it's got an opposite pole in the center than it does on the outside. You know, how do I fill that in? You know, it's stuck here, but it repels from the center because of opposite poles. So you could try and just shove it in there, but you're not going to be able to do so. Well, I was wrong about that. You can do so. I'm getting a big rappel here, but when I go down to push it down in there, it gets pulled right in. That's because of the opposite pole in the center. Flux goes out of the top and into the back end. With So, if I flip it over, I can't get it in. There's no way I can shove that down there if I do. It's going to want to fly out and it's not very stable so what you can do i come up with this idea using the magnetic shielding that i talked about in the last video but just by putting steel around it's not really shielding but it works in a similar way in our favor what you can do is put one of those put this into here and what you end up with is a magnet with all north on one side and not south in the middle. All, so all south on the other side and not north in the middle. So it's a, it's a two-sided magnet with two sides with two poles. So it's basically a, just a solid magnet now. Anyways, so that's one little trick that I found out. And I just want to share it because I think it has some purposes, such as uh, putting a, one of those on a magnetic swinging pendulum, per se. Nice big heavy magnet. Anyways, talk to you later.